in most countries, there's a concept of what we in South Africa call assess losses. What they are is if you've got and you've made some losses prior, you can actually claim them back before you have to pay taxes. It's quite important that you calculate it correctly because it will affect when you pay cashes, which is a cash flow effect. The actual calculation to work out whether you should pay tax or not is just a simple bucket. So you'll see what we've got here. We've got an assessed loss. We've got an opening balance. So we've typed in. And then we've got, I've put a minus 200. That's my assessed loss. I've got all these profits here. I need to know what will the tax be. And you'll see it's using the tax rate multiplied by how much is taxable. In terms of the assessed loss calc, we've got an opening balance of minus 200. What I've said here is this is what our profit is before tax. Perhaps we've got some other allowances we can claim. And there should be a closing balance. I'm just gonna say sum. So when I do that, this opening balance is the same as that closing balance, and I can copy it across. Now for assessed losses, that's relevant, because if we've got an assessed loss, we definitely don't pay taxes. But the moment we get here, it actually becomes irrelevant. This is now we're taxable. So just to make it easier to see, I'm going to build the if function in here. And what the if function is going to say is if that sum over there is bigger than zero, then just put a zero. Otherwise, just add up whatever's there. So when I copy and paste it across, you'll see I've now got when we're in assessed loss, we've got a negative here. When we're not, We've got zeros. So how much are we actually taxable? So the first thing we know is I'm going to say if that cell over there is less than zero, then just put zero. Don't even bother calculating. We're not paying any taxes. There's nothing taxable at that point. If it's not, however, we need to now work out how much are we taxable. Now you've got to be a little bit careful here. What you should do is if you use this here, there may be a point, for example, over here, we've got a little bit left over. So if we were over here building the calculation, it would say zero. If we used this number, we'd pay too much tax because there was a little bit left over. So what we're going to say is how much are we taxable? It's going to be the opening balance plus the profit before tax plus any additional allowance we allowed. Close it. When I copy it across, You'll see at this point, it now tells us there's 70 taxable. So it would normally be the 120 less that 20, but we've got a 30 start. And here, even though we're referring to the opening balance, we know it'll be zero because of the formula we created here. So this will then effectively just do our normal calculation. So this is just so that we don't accidentally pay too much tax over here.